For number 20 here, to integrate this, first thing I want to do is take this little 3 and send it off the edge. Because I can and I will. Now, the 3 can go out front, so I can multiply by the x, so I get 3x. And this becomes ln x. And don't forget little dx. Next step, I would probably next pull out the 1 third just so it's a little bit prettier. Okay. Next. That doesn't help me. Except, if I make this U, the derivative of that would be 1 over x dx. And 1 over x dx, isn't that right here? Don't you have 1 over x dx? Okay, it's kind of, without practice, it's like, how the heck did you see that? Because I'm good, but when you have practice, you'll be good too. <laughs> now, so, that will end up being 1 over u du. Because du is 1 over x dx, and that's a u. Okay, the integral of 1 over u, hopefully you'll know by now, d to the 1 third is ln absolute value u, and plus c. Don't forget plus c. And u, again, was ln x, so let's plug that in. And that would be ln x plus c. Now, that is your answer. What's something else we could do if we really felt like it? We could take that one-third and make this a cube root of ln x. Not necessary. All the time. Sometimes it is, sometimes not, depending on what you're asking for.